Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. We are back with some more Nightwish. Um, no, Tracy asked us to listen to this, and so here we are, you ladies. <coughs> yeah, this anything? is a the newest one from them that just came out like I think maybe a week ago. The day of. So yes. yeah. Right. So and right, I well, do I have I have the lyrics. We have the lyrics, and we kind of read through them because. We want to be able to understand the words to the song. So uh, Tracy made that clear. We should have the lyrics for sure. So we did it, Tracy. Yes. we. Uh, I understood the assignment. <laughs> Lacey read the lyrics to us just right before we started recording. So, yeah. But we haven't heard it yet. So you, you ladies ready? Yes. Oh, yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. A new virus has now been discovered. Oh. You may be Oh, oh, I think I was right about what I said. <coughs> oh, zombie! Take shelter, skies are homing. Armageddon, second coming. War of the world, the end of history. Take shelter, floods are rising. Okay, so what I was thinking is like when we were reading the lyrics, I didn't really understand the reference to 84. Uh, but I think in, uh, let me see. Uh, she says uh, this grave new world of 84. <laughs> I remember in actually a Tom McDonald song, funny enough, uh, where he talks about George Orwell, 1984 was his last lecture and talking about uh, he, he had written a book um, and he was talking about the, uh, the thought police or whatever. And I, I feel like that's the vibe I get from this, like with the, the zombies and the playing, like almost like propaganda on the TV. So I wonder if that's a George Orwell reference. Yeah, I'd be I, interested to know. I started it all over from the beginning. I thought we would just go back. Yeah. So maybe like with that context in mind, like when she says that, I, I'd be curious to know if y'all, if y'all think that's what, what it might be. All right. I don't okay. know. I heard this one was a, a little kind of like political or controversial for them. Yeah. So. Okay. I'm going with the context I got. So yeah, let's hear it from the beginning again. All right. I like this so far from the beginning though. It's kind of like, it's got a cool beat. Yeah. And the production's awesome. Yeah. Several people have been evacuated from the site, but approximately.
Well. So what did y'all think? Um, well, for one, I, I always seem to like, because I'm not sure what order will come out in, but I love like the videos have been very captivating to me mm -hmm. and they have been telling a lot of the story of what's going along with the lyrics, even though sometimes I struggle just a little bit with the lyrics. Um, but I, it was very, it almost reminded me of like something like that you could see, like even with like her singing and how certain parts were almost like a chanting. So mm -hmm. like, it kind of reminded me of like, like a musical or a play or something along yeah. those lines. And like the video, like set all that together. Um, yeah. So uh, I, I really enjoyed the visuals again in this video. Um, I, I really like the video productions a lot. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, kind of gave me a little zombie vibe. Just a little. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I like zombies. Definitely... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, um, since I knew that it was kind of controversial, I kind of went with that when I interpreted some of this stuff. And it made me think of people being like exposed to like the fear mongering and propaganda machine and like being brainwashed through the machine or like the system that is like the global system. Right. Because no matter what country you go to, there is some sort of system right. that is like eventually controlling the people and like, you know, almost like bleeding them dry or like which is kind of what the like the zombie look gave me. Like, you know, they've just been deteriorated to like nothingness because they've been you know everything like they mentioned y2k and some of the other stuff they had mentioned right. in there had to do with like fear mongering in a, in a sense like oh all the computers are going to crash and everything's going to end you know it's always about the, the world ending it never actually ends but they use that fear all the time to uh like to control people with like you know first it was like the ozone layer right we're all going to die because the ozone layer is being eaten away and then now it's uh now it's something else it's like you know it's a uh, what is the thing now, you know, the, the environment or, or whatever, you know, it's like a global warming. That's what it is. Global warming. First it was the ozone layer. Now it's global warming. Before that it was something else or the ice glaciers are melting and uh, all it was always something to like scare people into control, right? Like it's easy to control people who are frightened because they're going to look to who they think has all the answers. And in the end, uh, you know, where we just disappear into nothingness which is like what I see is like the album, them all just floating off into space into and nothingness the, because that's, that's what's left at the end of the day when it's all been destroyed. At the very beginning of the video here, let me pull it up. I'm not going to, we're not going to play it yet, but well, yeah. At the very beginning. I am not like them or Sorry. the others. Don't back down. I, I don't want to talk about AI. Dollars. They talk about AI too. <laughs> AI is going to kill everybody. Okay, yeah, this lady at the beginning yeah. here. It's fine. Okay. She has I think a, that's her. That's Floor. Okay, but she has like a a, a um I, I guess a, like a, a uniform. Type. No, yeah. it's it's like a like a army uniform, like a like, oh, a like an old military uniform. Yeah. yeah. But old it kind of it kind of represents in a way like maybe even a dictator. Yeah, well that's what I mean is like our government has basically yeah. become like See? it's like just a multi multi person dictatorship in some sort sort of way, you know. See now I interpreted that role of that person a little different. Mm -hmm. So um same concept, but like the drops that she's doing, like so she's already awake and so she's awakening the rest from okay. everything else that suppressed them. Okay. So that's how I interpret it. Like she's waking them up. Okay. Oh, With I the, like was like that's how I yeah, yeah. I, like, I, they're all I like this and then as soon as like they she puts out they snap up and all of a sudden the 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 screen starts flashing with fear and yeah. all this bad stuff and they're like like almost like forcing them to watch it like almost like she's being controlled by somebody and she's helping them because she is being controlled like she already done went down the droppy rabbit hole or whatever kind of like the gone. zombie vibe like she's making that them. makeup though. That oh my god, crazy. that's sick. Y'all see that? As a makeup she, artist, respect. She needs some moisture. She needs some moisturizer. She's looking a little cracky and dry. She needs some moisturizer. Yeah, actually, yeah, I just that don't, I still just interpreted that opposite. Like, yeah. like that she was the one bringing people out of and like reminding them of what all these fears were. But like, I, I just, I interpret it different. I guess it's, that's what's good about sometimes with the video, right? It's up to interpretation. Because yeah. well, I think with like the way the lyrics went, 
and like what I was watching, it, it to me, I thought she was bringing them out of something, not like putting them into something. See, speaking, I feel like they were already kind of blinded to everything, and she was waking them up so they could see. Like that's how I looked at it. But speaking yeah, on the I makeup guess. aspect of it, though, real quick, I actually have the stuff to make that kind of face, like that that cracky skin. Oh, you should do it. Oh no, no, <laughs> no. But I uh, mean, like for an art thing, like oh, that you know, could you be do cool. The like. Yeah, you could do like a Nightwish um, reinterpretation. Yeah, yeah, do your face and then do it like. Y'all down cool. for that? Y'all, y'all let us know if y'all would like to see that. I could, I could do. Yeah. It. Uh, cool. But yeah, you know, it's it's interesting. Everybody, let us know in the comments how you interpret it and what you take from it. And y'all are familiar with kind of the way they write. Uh, I don't, I don't really always understand the their lyrics the way they write. It's it's very poetic. Mm -hmm. um, and I definitely cannot write like that, but I don't always, the meanings are not always clear. Like, for me. Yeah, because earlier you said something about like Shakespeare ish. You know? Yeah, well, like kind of like the way, sh you know, Shakespeare, um, it, it takes, it took me a long time to really understand Shakespeare. And I had a teacher in school that kind of helped me with that in freshman year. But, you know, just the way they write is very, it's very poetic and it's very beautiful and it tells a story, but I don't always know what they're talking, what, what they're trying to convey to me because I don't understand the way they, they phrase things. It's too things. proper for us Texans. <laughs> so it's, it's just, it's very poetic. And so there's a meeting and stuff behind it all. It's just sometimes I don't always understand. I just, right. you know, I'm not that up on like poetry, I guess, but I love I love lyrics in general, so I try and take from it what I can. And um, it helps that she is an incredible singer and they're an incre incredible mm. band and the video is always interesting. So I love that. But it was it was definitely one of my one of the ones I've liked uh, more than a lot of the other ones. Like, yeah, I'm not gonna say it's my favorite, but I really I really enjoyed it. I thought it was really cool. Her voice is really chill. Like, it yeah, just, I it's this like one in the one that we it's like satin and honey. Really and right. Right. Yeah. She just has an incredible voice. It's just crazy. Yes. All right, mm -hmm. guys. Well, that was uh, Nightwish, the day of. Um, and make sure you guys uh, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell so you get notified anytime the Bettys uh, drop. And if you want to help support the channel, those will be linked uh, in, in the description below as well. Yeah. And until next time, guys, peace out.